And I try to find out how they met, what kind of quirks they have that they enjoy about each other, maybe some common hobbies. We can theme that wedding to something that they wrap their heads around. So whether it's uh, their hobby, their concern, whether it represents their philosophy, religious preferences, spiritual preferences, hobby preferences, we'll wrap it around that. Uh, just about anywhere you can imagine having a wedding. Beaches, Museum of Flight, I've done it there. Matt and Stephanie, I met them at a Starbucks not far from their home and yeah, just got to know them a little bit. How they met, uh, what kind of work they do, what kind of hobbies and interests that they have together. And I asked them what they envision for their wedding. He will take care of everything, you know, in terms of that part of your wedding. And you won't have to worry. He'll be there on time. He'll make sure that everything you want is in, is in there and everything you don't want is also not in there. We didn't really want a lot of the, like, unity candle or you know any of that stuff so he kept it really basic because that's what we want. And after they told me that we worked on crafting a ceremony that reflected what they were looking at. They should choose me as an officiant because they're going to get the real deal. They'll get somebody with a lot of experience, reliability, I've never missed a wedding. I've in fact filled in for officiating weddings for somebody who had their officiant cancel, move, retire, die. And nobody's ever had to fill in for me. I'll be there and I will put them at ease.